Go ahead. Triple, baby. Let's go. Then let's <laughs> yeah. go, dude. Oh, God. Oh, God. I can't even find them in the binoculars. So, I can't really <laughs> see anything. <laughs> What is going on guys? Welcome back to the channel. Today, I'm with Tooth, not Toothless, Tooth, 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 Tooth Dustin. Hey yes, guys. For all, these, for all you guys wondering, Dustin did get his tooth fixed, so no longer Toothless. Yeah, I'm kind of ugly now. But Dustin was free this weekend, and I haven't hunted with him yet this fall, and we're like, hey, let's just go do a little bit of scouting in North Dakota, and see if we can get amongst them. So we're driving around right here and we got the old Onyx pulled up, obviously. And we're out yonder. We found a nice little feed for a two-man shoot tomorrow. We found a bigger feed, but unfortunately at the moment we can't get a hold of the guy. So probably not gonna hunt that place. Um, but out here is probably about, I don't know, 75 birds or so. And uh, it could be a decent little shoot for two people. We pulled up who owned the field on Onyx and we went to their house. They lived about three miles away and a lovely woman answered the door and she gave us permission to hunt this. And again, it was possible to find their place because once you use the Onyx app, you would know you can click on the place that you're looking at and it pulls up their tax address and their name. So it was super easy finding, went over there and we're good to go and legal for tomorrow. If you guys would like to check out the Onyx app, it'll be linked down below. If you click that link, you guys can save 20% off an annual membership. And it's an essential for the waterfowl season and any other type of hunting, it comes in handy. But I don't know if you guys are going to be able to see them in the camera, but pretty much in the center there, you guys might be able to see some of their heads and their dark bodies. That's where they are sitting. There's a body of water just east of here that we believe they roost on. So they're gonna come over just like this. We have a, I think like a 10 mile an hour south, southwest wind. So we'll set up accordingly for that. But Dustin and I are just gonna watch these birds for a little bit longer, go back home and go to bed responsibly because Dustin and I always go to bed responsibly before we go fishing and or hunting. <laughs> But I will plan on seeing you guys tomorrow morning when we're setting up and or driving out to the field. But catch you guys tomorrow morning. 12 seconds later. Elon Horse acting up a bit. Here we go, guys are running. Leaf throws a long loop. We've got a catch right out in front of our Cass County Electric Co-op. Uh, well, funny story, we were uh, driving home and uh, we were going to be responsible like we were talking about, like we always are, and we happened to pass a rodeo and Dustin was like, hey, want to hop in the rodeo and just see what's going on? So they got like Ferris wheels and stuff back there and obviously they got the bush light and some cowboy stuff going on right now. So I don't know, I thought it was kind of funny for the vlog, we're just going to film a little bit on what's going on here. And uh, I promise we will be responsible at some point in time. Here we go, Duke Barney. Come watch this guy. Watch his partner, Logan Top. Here we go. Pull that steer tight between the two. Them look like some nice wieners, huh? Those are some beautiful glizzies. Oh, God. Oh, God. Hmm. Mm -hmm. Ooh. I feel like when you go to a carnival or like a fair, the corn dog and funnel cake is a staple. So we had to make it happen. We gotta get some food in us before we hit these mad rides over here. All right, Bucko, you're up. We're doing a little dart throwing. We're doing some dart throwing. Hey, we got one. 
We got two. So what's that mean, though? I have no clue. Oh, okay. We're just hitting balloons. Okay. You know, tell me which one you're gonna aim for, then I'll zoom in on that one. The red one. Right there? Yeah, next to my dart that I just Yep, threw. all right, all right. And we're gonna go for the yellow one between my two darts now. Yep, oh yeah, 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 yep. You wanna throw the last one? I'll throw the last one. All right. I don't know, like, is there any point system here? Probably should ask that, you just, all right, I'm just, I'm just gonna go for whatever this hits. Hey. Did we win big? Let's go. Which one? <laughs> I'll, I'll, I want this one. Dang. I want one of those big ones. Hey, look at this. Me and Dustin just threw some darts. We got, I don't know, what kind of, what is that? A greeble. A hamster? All right, we got a colorful hamster. Dart throwing. That was cool. Hey, what's this? Lock party. Hey, you can oh, you can win man. the Fortnite llama back there. I want the Rolling Stone sign. Wait, this what? This is live. This is live. This is live. You're giving one for free. I know. Free? I am for free. What? Both of you. Don't Both fuck of it up. Us? All the girls are watching. All the girls. Are, okay. Well, shout out to my guy here. Let me what see it. What are we it. doing? Just knocking him off the table. Hit all three, you lose. All right. All we right. We go for big prizes. So get it, get it, get it, get it. Come on, Bucko. Oh, not bad. Doesn't win. Oh, boy. Hit. Hit it, dude. Airball. What is that? It was all right. It's all right. Hey, hey, thank, thank you. Best. Thank you. That was fun. That you guys was fun. be good. Thank you. I botched that so bad. I, that was embarrassing, guys. I promise. I played some type of sports in college, but hey, this is fun. We're just walking around doing random things. Hopefully, the lighting's all right. There's a lot of games, though. It looks pretty cool. Oh god, I don't, I don't even know what that is. It's a coin pusher. Oh, uh, see, I'm not about the coin pushers. Yeah. Hey, Dustin, that looks like a you thing right there. What? That. Fortnite? Yeah. What up? Hit a Fortnite dance. Hey, let's go. Run up the city, you know how we turn up. I run with the ball, she get caught with a burner. I want to play Little Man <laughs> Jay over this whole thing. All right, so Dustin and I are talking. Uh, we were looking at this thing. And uh, John scared. I'm, well, yeah, that corn dog might not be sitting well right now. That's all I gotta say. Dude, that funnel cake and corn brat with the jalapeno cheddar cheese is sitting so nice right now. I'm ready to hit that carousel ride zipper thingy. Right on, brother. Right on. Right on, brother. Right on. Well, it's almost our turn. Has your glizzy settled? My glizzy has settled, so hopefully this goes well. Good. Oh, yep. Oh, God. Welcome to the war, boys. <laughs> this shall be interesting, right, Dustin? Oh, this shall be. I'm gonna hold the camera as long as possible. Don't know how long that's gonna be, though, boys. Oh, God. Oh God. Yep, we, we're up there now. We're loading people on right now and then we're gonna get ripping here soon. But there is a good chance my phone may fall all the way to the fairground. Stop rocking us! <laughs> Stop rocking us, bro! <laughs> oh! <laughs> oh hell no, bro! Again, bro. Oh my god. No boys, I'm actually finna puke. I'm not even lying to you. This is not good, Dustin. I feel like this is I'm never going on this again. Bro, I feel so right now. Like, I don't even know. We were like doing uh, there's one point in town where we were doing some rolls, like a whole 360 backwards. I still feel like I'm moving. I don't know about you, but I that was so scary. I am never doing that again. Never. Dustin, I'm never listening to you. I feel like that was a great plan. I had a great time. I feel great. 
I'm ready to shoot some birds in the morning and go do some responsible sleeping. The next day. Morning. Morning. How was your responsible night of sleeping? Pretty good. Pretty good. My cat kept me up. Dang cats. I just got a kitty. Bro, you look good because like the back there's like a sunrise coming up. It looks kind of sexy. Damn, that was sexy right there. Well guys, it is the next morning after a responsible night of sleeping and not doing anything else. We are out at the field. Let me show you our hide. So you guys guessed it right. They are uh, feeding in a black field pretty much with some, I don't know, like maybe some cover crop or just some stuff from leftover from last year. I don't have no idea. But we found that they were kind of feeding by this tall green stuff. So we decided to go in here. And I mean, that looks pretty good to me. We got it all brushed in with the ghillie blankets. I think we blend in nice. That shouldn't be a problem. And then as for a spread, we got the owls out there kind of in a Nike swoosh. They are coming from the east, we think. So we're gonna try cross shooting them with like this south, southwest wind. And hopefully it goes good. But we got here plenty of time. We're gonna watch a good sunrise and hopefully shoot some geese. Let me see that thing on you. Shout out to Sam. He left his GoPro with me. So, oh, you look like a beast, dude. Welcome to the war zone, boys. We're dropping hot. What are you dropping? Control every time. That is sexy right there. Well, it is officially shooting light and we are just waiting on birds now. The mosquitoes are relentless out here. They're biting me and dust and we spray it up and they're still eating us. So I busted out a thermocell. I, I went and bought one and we're gonna see if it works today. It says you're supposed to wait like 15 minutes after you turn it on and it creates like a 15 feet or something like radius, like a circle where they won't get you. That is her right there. I don't know if you can hear her hissing or not, but it's on. So hopefully the geese show back up and hopefully the mosquitoes buzz off. <laughs> you see I did there. I seen that. Damn, they kind of hugged that left side, eh? Get him. Well, we just had the first group come in. We saw some other ones land over there. Are these geese right here, Dustin, in front of us? Yeah. All right, we got a line right coming right out of Dustin and I right now. You load it back up? Yeah. Okay. I hope they don't hug me like that. Yeah, me too. <laughs> Is this still recording? Yep, you're good. Oh god, Dustin. <laughs> Get him. Get him. Oh no. All right, well, we just had two groups come in. Uh, the first group, there was like four of them came over here. We dropped two out of them. They hugged this side. I shot one, Dustin shot one. No, that first group. Oh, that, that first, first group. group. Yeah, yeah. yeah. And then we had like a wad father of like 20 geese, like right in front of our faces. I shot one and then I shot another one, but that one kind of sailed away. I thought I had him down too. <sighs> there we go. There's one of them. And then there should be another one. That was, uh, that second group, Dustin, was pretty gnarly, dude. Yeah. That was sick. 
Oh my god. After after I sh we shot like the first time though, they all just kind of like really got like I don't know. There's not much wind. They just kind of like carried that way, super fast. There we go. We got some birds down. Um, there should be. I would say some more birds coming. I mean, that was a decent amount of birds right there. Probably seen maybe half of the birds, but that was sick. Ah! Shall we wipe out our five pack? Oh, we can. Ah, ah, ah. Ah, ah, ah. These two are, these two are fine. I'm not sure these two are weak. Let's fine. land them. Let's land these two. Triple baby, let's go! Then let's <laughs> yeah. go, dude! I tripled and then you quadded? Yeah. Oh. <laughs> we just shot seven out of that group, bro. Are you kidding me? Go ahead. Strip, baby. Let's go. I quadded. Did, let's <laughs> yeah. go, dude. Oh my god, dude. That was sick, dude. Holy cow, guys. We just had three groups come at once. Two, okay, they came over and did a couple circles. Two committed really well, but we waited for the bigger pack. And thank God we did. I shot three and Dustin shot four. <laughs> Two of them lined up right Bro. here. I was like, yo. <laughs> Dude, that's awesome. Let's go. That was absolutely gnarly. I just I can't believe Dustin shot four and I shot three. That was that was awesome. I shot like crap the first two groups, but when it mattered, I uh, pulled it together and got it done. It's hard to miss those shots though because they were so close. This is already turning out to be pretty awesome. <laughs> Oh, I think he's dead. Uh, that makes 12. We got him. Well, Dustin was on the phone. We're hanging out. The flight kind of slowed down a little bit and a single just came dumping in. And uh, I decided to hold the big camera. I was like, Dustin, you shoot this. And he is dead. I'm gonna laugh if this is banded though. This would be kind of funny. Nope, no bands. But there we go. Good job, Dustin. Nice shot. So that puts Dustin and I at 12 this morning for just two guys. Not bad at all. Um, I probably, we should have like maybe three, three or four more. I was shooting pretty bad in the morning, which pretty typical for me, but we're just gonna wait it out a little bit longer, see if we can pull any more birds. But this has been one heck of a hunt so far. Get him. Oh, I need
get him. Oh, I missed. Well, there we go. Another four down. Like I said, we had a, a bigger pack and another like six pack like come over us and then they circled around and went back that way. And then we had probably like a, like I said, like an eight pack or so. Just do it nice and nice and dirty right there. I shot two and Dustin shot two. What do you think so far of the hunt today? Dude, it's going pretty good. I mean, I wasn't expecting anything too great today with uh, the size of the feed, but you know, our hide's good. It was better than it looked like from the road. I mean, looking at this field from the road, it looks like a just a tilled up weed field kind of, but there's some tall weeds out here that they were feeding by. So we were lucky enough to get in here with our, our ghillie blankets and we got some good hide. Birds are doing it right. And we're shooting halfway decent. starting to flare. Oh, well, Dustin and I were taking a nap and all of a sudden I looked, I looked up and I, oh, oh, I looked up and I did see a six pack coming in. Okay. Well, we got them. They were starting to flare a little bit out of us, out of ways from us. So we had to take the shot. Dang it. I thought they were coming right in though. Not bad, not bad for a little two-man shoot. Ended up with 17 honk daddies. Ain't that right, Mr. Pound Town? Oh, we got them all right, Johnny boy. We got them. Did you have fun today? Because, like, you've gone out. This is only your third time you got out this, this year, right? Yeah. Okay, and this is the most you've shot so far, right? Yeah, yeah. Opening weekend was pretty tough for me and the boys. Obviously, I wasn't hunting with John and the boys. But uh, yeah, I was glad to get out here with John today. We had a banger of a two-man hunt. We got 17 geese, can't beat that. Well, ladies and gents, we are wrapping up this hunt. Uh, this was kind of a wild video. I mean, it went from scouting last night to driving home and seeing a carnival, stopping over at the carnival, eating hot dogs, watching a rodeo, participating in some games and almost vomiting on a roller coaster. Yeah, quite quite the interesting vlog here, but I hope you guys enjoyed all the content. I like bringing the camera and just kind of filming a little bit of everything. I wish there would have been more big camera footage of this day because we had some groups, like big groups, do it absolutely gnarly, but I mean, there's only two of us, so I had to shoot as well. But if you guys enjoyed today's video, drop a comment down below, let me know. If you wanna see another video with Dustin, also let me know. He's a little busy now, he's a big roofing guy and uh, he's doing a little bit of, little bit of hunting with the Smackin' Boys too. So if we wanna see more of us together, let us know. But other than that, guys, I have nothing else for you. Thank you so much for watching, and we will catch you guys on the next one.